Yeah, I do have some potions left if I want to heal quickly. Yeah, I'll use a health potion. I should be I should be fine past this point. It might be worth putting some points into intelligence just so I can fit some more um uh just so I can Intelligence or just strength. I've been kind of neglecting all of my stats except for agility. I'm a I'm one of those shitty Isakay characters. Aren't I? Uh yeah I yeah. am. Kindle. Fire damage to the next attack. Nope, none of these are particularly helpful. Quick step. Can't upgrade quick step. Bandage. Be nice if I could upgrade bandage. So currently I'm only healing 40 points of health. Yeah, let's keep upgrading that. And we've hit max on, on heal. Right, I've got stat points to put into things. Get resurrect. I should probably get resurrect, maybe. Okay, so increases damage with melee weapons. If I do that, it doesn't increase the damage directly. Iffy on that one. Some magic points. Or I could just let's let's keep pumping agility. Biggest problem I'm running into is just I need to stab the shit out of my enemies. There we go. That's not so bad. Let's see. No channel power rune? I've got the channel power rune. It should just uh, stay active while it's in my inventory. Okay, so return to the surface, and we've got another monolith. So I should probably go check that out. A lot of these mad cultists all over the place. The one thing I think this game does kind of lack is enemy variety. It's only got like a handful. That's not that big of a deal, but you know, it'd be neat if we had uh, some more along the way. Okay, another wanderer. Heal. Probably should have maybe given a potion. We have a town up there. Good to know. Oh, you have to equip it. Good to know. Well, that hurt a bit, but that's fine. Okay. Hooded figure. Holding some treasure. Doesn't notice you. We'll buy the mysterious potion. We get a kite shield. Well, let's get rid of the other kite shield. I don't know if the grim kite shield of purity is at all useful. Okay. And most of these aren't that helpful. So it looks like we do have some stuff up here if I want to head that direction. Let's head to the uh, monolith first, though. Okay. I'll have to figure out what to give. We've got an orb that I don't care too much about. Approach, make an offering, give an orb give offering. Okay, and I get a skill point. Good. So I've maxed out heal at this point. Might be worth putting some into intelligence just to buff that up a little bit more, because I assume that's how you upgrade it. Do we have anything else here? I guess we could learn resurrection at this point. Just in case. Uh, let's get up here. What the hell is this? It's uh, ascended. Okay. It's got like, it's a weird bird creature with a mask tied to its waist. It's very strange. We get a beast eye. One of these has got to be a fort. I hope. Okay, we have another wanderer. Talk to them. Talk rumors. Oh, marked a treasure on the map. Uh, I don't know. Okay, so let's inspect. Kulfek Manor. Village. Ah, has a guild. Has inn and a potion shop. 
Well, uh, let's head this way first. I don't know where the darkness is, and if I have to just stab a sea serpent on, along the way, then that's what I'll do. Okay, and we get a bright ring of haste. But yeah, I've got like three or four potions to turn in. I don't have enough bandit's teeth, but I do have that one. Special guild robe. Dang it! Well, let's... Let's get rid of the half-moon dagger. Okay, my reputation's up. You know what? We'll do quest in a second. Let's go to the weapon shop. None of these are particularly helpful. Let's start selling some garbage. Some of these might actually be upgrades, now that I'm thinking about it. So let's take a look at the guild special robe. Yeah, that's straight up better than anything I have. Grim Kite Shield of Purity. I mean, defense is nice. The rest of it, not so nice. Health drains slower and damage is taken. Meh. So, Charnel Power Rune. Do I equip it over a ring? No. Oh, I equip it there. I'm not sure if I want that. It's two points to every stat, but in... Yeah, I'll do it. Bright Ring of Haste. Intellect and move speed. Uh... What is movement speed? Is that for, like, traveling on the overworld? Because that might actually be really, really good. Four agility, crit chance, though. Ooh, that might be better. Let's get the Ring of Frenzy. What's this one? Mighty Ring of Doom. It's not so great. Let's get rid of any of the uh, cursed items. We don't care that much. Ring of Frenzy. Vitality and crit chance. Ring of Fury. Agility and attack speed. Let's roll that. Let's let's be the, uh, the speed monger that I always wanted it to be. Mind shield runes. Not that helpful. Doom shield. Okay. Mighty slippers of wealth. Strength gold finds and magic item find. Versus intellect and travel distance. Hell yeah. Hardy Ring of Frenzy. I think we looked at this. I considered it, but no. Okay, uh, let's see. So we've got some inventory space. Let's see. Corrupt Summoner Robe of Frenzy. Minus Regeneration. That's scary. Keep some blue stuff for monoliths. Uh, we haven't found any immediately, and they do tend to give us quite a lot of monoliths as we go by. Do I need the lantern at this point? I don't think I do. Lantern, iron key, note, silver key. And I can get rid of the monolith research paper. Because I don't think I need that either. Okay. So all of these, my bags, yeah, they're all empty. Good. Back to the inn. Quests. Are you strong enough? Okay, you won't believe this potion. I don't have enough of that. Skeleton's my area. Did have enough of that. Okay, choose a new skill. So we've maxed out heal. Critical focus. Critical focus isn't a bad idea. Anything else I can get here? No. Are there any other, uh... Are there any other skills I should be looking for on the available list? Because, like, Kindle doesn't seem that useful, but there might be a tree that I should care about. Because mostly I've been eyeballing critical focus, which I think I'll go for. At least for now. Vigilance. Okay. Makes sense. Okay, and I don't have enough bandit teeth or whatever. Let's check the, uh... Regeneration, movement speed, and travel distance. It's kind of nice, but I prefer the attack speed here. And that... 
is probably not better than Brock's Helm. Yeah, it's not. It's kind of okay. The regeneration is nice. Let's see, rename bags. That's a good point. Okay, so we've got the parts bag. The main problem is just like, uh, I don't know which one to chuck. Okay, you can use guild storage to store stuff like uh, demon wards. You know, that's a good point, actually. Let's go storage. We have the map of Kingsway. Oh. So I'm on the wrong side of the law here. Okay. I'm gonna pump all this into intellect for once. So now I know where to go. I probably should have actually carried this with me. Let's throw it in my bag. And let's throw all the demon wards. All the beast eyes. I'm gonna hold on to a king's icon. But like demon wards and stuff? Nah, I don't need those I don't need those in my inventory. They're not very heavy, it's mostly just clutter. So you need one more living seed and a bunch of bandit's teeth. Unfortunately I haven't fought fought a whole lot. Put the map on the desktop itself. Oh, can I? Oh, sweet. Yeah, unfortunately we got the notification about having the map in storage. Uh, uh more or less well after I had the ability to do anything. Okay. So I am probably going to head for that treasure and then let's head for the beacons. Help the wanderer. We extend your want to extend your life. Oh, that's interesting. Crop Sword of Fury. I guess I'll grab it. Uh, let's take a look at this. Skull, two living seeds, one beast eye. Gets me a vitality potion. Okay. So I guess I should have held on to some skulls. Oh, that's life. Okay, so what, is, what does this place have? Inn and a potion shop. Don't care about those. Now... If my intelligence is increased... Okay, maybe I can get a skull this way. If my intelligence is increased, does my mana uh, recover faster too? Or no? No way! We are not selling Brog's Helm here. That's a terribly stupid idea. Okay, we get a treasure chest, we avoid the arrow, we get a way crystal, another potion, and a ball maze. That's not as cool as I would have thought. Also, I'm putting everything into the wrong inventory. Okay. So there's the creeping horror. Well, worst comes to worst, we, uh, like we suggested, just fight it out. Be kind of nice if I could just put those things in the uh, parts bag. Okay, we actually do need to fight some more shrub lords. Living seed into the parts bag. I guess I'll just shrink down the parts bag and chuck it over here. Kind of with the same thing with the my bag. Use the feather. I will use the feather as soon as I'm in a safe-ish spot. Iron Helm, do I carry any of these around? I'll grab the robe. Okay, so what's the feather? Feather of the Ascendant, properties. Increase all stats for each item equipped. No, the feather's, the feather's no good. I don't have any cursed items. Okay, so we do have a treasure over there. Is it worth it to run for a treasure?
It's probably not worth it to head for that treasure chest. It, I mean, it seems like most of the good loot is all locked away in dungeons. And everything else is just kind of tertiary. It doesn't look like the, uh... Oh, we've come across an enchanted healing fountain. How much inventory is... Oi. I really wish I could actually select how much gold I want to drop. Now let's go down to 600. I think that, that'll be reasonable. I was really hoping I could press both or, like, hold it down, but no. Well, leaving gold for my future self. Should be fine. Okay, let's leave. We want to go down and around this way. Unless I can cross this, you know, I can cross the sea. Forgotten dwelling, unlock the chest, open the chest, has a broadsword. Too full and an invisibility potion. Bedroom, don't want to rest in the bed. Hall has a zombie in it, don't care too much about zombies. They uh, don't really concern me that much. Ma monolith research paper. Okay. Uh, let's check the map of King's Way. So let's see if I can cross the ocean. It looks like with the, the new loot I've chucked on, I'm doing a fair, fairly good job. Please tell me I can reach over there. Deserted home, library, another ascended. Yeah, with the new gear I've got on, I'm having a lot easier time just cutting through enemies. Another beast eye. Sadly, don't need those. Check the bookcases. Scroll of burn. Bedroom, kitchen, nursery. It has a chest. Chest has scythes. Mighty scythe of leech. What does that do? Strength and lifesteal. It's not bad. Okay, so sadly we cannot, so I'm going to have to go around. Ah, there's a monolith down there, though. Come on, give me our skull. I really do like the idea of bullying them. Okay, cool. Bart's bag, and we don't care about the long cleaver. You know, this also reminds me of Idol Quest. It'd almost be kind of interesting to play a game like this where you have like a bunch of different adventurers rolling around like this. And your goal is not to, uh, you know... Uh, your goal is not to kill them before the, uh, the darkness comes along, but just like... You're just an adventure manager with... And it's kind of like hands-off and you're just watching, watching them move around. Okay. Oh, why is it up there? What the hell is a, a screamer? Just not comfortable looking. Nothing to loot. What level am I? 12. Okay, so I'm doing fine. Yeah, we are picking up quite a lot of demons here, but... I mean, if we're lucky, once the darkness hits, I'll just be able to chuck through them. Uh, like normal, I guess. Game is conspiring to kill me. I, I mean, so, I'm gonna be totally honest, I went into this with the expectation that I was gonna kinda throw it at some point. And then I haven't been able to. You know, usually I make like a risky, risky decision at some point and just be like, well, them's the breaks. I mean, that's not actually what I usually do. Usually I'm just like, eh, you know, I'll make it as far as I can go. Unfortunately, I'm making it as far as I can go and then some. Okay, where, do, what? No, oh, it's all the way up there. Oh! The more monoliths you light, the more demons you'll encounter. Good to know. Well, I'm poisoned. Balls. We got a fancy orb. I assume poison goes away eventually, yeah? Hardy chainmail of flight. Oh, 
Well, I can always stop by the town and see if I can buy a, a potion if I wanted to. Right, I'm not immune to curses anymore. So I gotta care a little bit more about curses. Okay, another orb. Minimize. Can I just minimize these and have them, uh, function? I don't... I assume so. Takes a while with that, the antidote potion. Well, I'm not taking as much damage as, as I was. Prior to this. So, I'm just kind of wrecking things. Okay, so there should be... Oh! This is a whole location. Okay, well this is fine. Yeah, so I'm just acting really risky. Okay. Uh, so there's a beast man. You get closer, you crunch some twigs. Uh, if you come to fight me too, ask about the stolen shipment. Seems to be eating something. Get closer. Uh, half empty crate of food supplies and the Adventurer's Guild logo on it. Ask him about the stealing and killing. I didn't kill anyone. I only stole the shipment because I was hungry. I don't like hunting. Take the crate away from him. Okay, so we can take the stolen supplies. Bag is too full. Bag is too full. Son of a... Uh, can I put it... Can I put it into the parts bag? Cool. So we just robbed a dude. The hell kind of weird demon looking thing is this? It's like permanently doing the Matrix. Bullet time, I guess. Okay, you'll get another cave of this shape with a bunch of cult cultists. With, uh... Nope, no, damn it. Well, it's fine. We're kicking ass and taking names and then some. Items must be put in a bag. I did. Stupid inter interface. Wish it was a little bit more forgiving. Okay. Well, let's travel back here. I was going on a trip, damn it. But I guess I can never leave Beast Eye. Yeah, that darkness will catch up to me at some point. Okay, protect yourself from bandits. Nope, no bandits' teeth. Uh, still haven't gotten the skill. Okay, one supply crate. So we level up. Uh, let's see, so what do we get? Let's get Vigilance while we're here. Reputation's increased. Okay, and we also have the Guild Special Armor. Plus two to all stats versus... Critical damage. Yeah, that's probably better than what I've got. Put on the guild special armor. Let's throw away the mage robe. Grab the special robe. Can't get rid of the ball mace. Okay. And having a bunch of int was kind of nice. I'm going to pump it into strength at this point. i got to do some more damage. So we need some bandit's teeth, some living seeds. I assume I haven't got any more living seeds since we started this. No, we did. And we got a skull, actually. Okay, so let's go back. Let's go storage. Living seed. Living seed. Quests. So, what do we want? The Foded Potion or Extend Your Life? Let's do this one. Vitality Potion. Drink. What am I, what am I currently at? 179. To... It didn't seem to have increased my health at all. I am poisoned. Thanks. And the Foded Potion is good. Unfortunately, it's too late. Well, let's buy the Crescent Potion. You know, I should probably actually pay more attention to these. Uh. User interface is awkward. Okay, and the weapon shop doesn't have anything fancy. 
Well, that's fine. Let's get rid of... Actually, you know what? Parts bag shouldn't have any items in it. Okay, Vitality Potion gave me 1,000 EXP. Oh, that kind of makes sense. Okay, so we've got the Mighty So... Let's... Let's keep rings and stuff around. Rings and orbs will be my, uh... Rings and orbs will be my... Uh, the stuff that I specific sell. Or specifically, like, keep around to, uh, use on monoliths, because they're much lighter, I think? No, never mind, orbs are pretty heavy. Well, I'll keep the rings around at the very least. From now on. Okay, let's shrinky-do these. Because, yeah, I have to have them open. Otherwise, we run into problems. But it doesn't mean I have to have a very big window. Okay, and I don't see anything particularly useful here. So, I have one more stat point. I'm just going to chuck it into strength. Okay, world map, back, back. Map of King's Way. So... Do I want to go to the right? No, let's go to the left. Let's... If I skirt the darkness for a little while, I skirt the darkness for a little while. I don't want to block, damn it. That's fun. It's split. Makes sense, honestly. Okay, demon tools. What's well, this one? What do you want? Five demon wards, we get an iridescent charm. Well, that's easy. I've got wards and then some. Oh, and... Skeleton Knight. I don't think we need some more, uh... I don't think we need any more... anything. Hardy Sword of Doom. Cool. I'll just chuck it in my backpack. Yeah, so we might we might skirt darkness for a little bit here. We'll see if it's uh if it's a problem or not. I don't know, but I level up again already. So flee, magical shield, kindle, throw coin, strong attack. Most of these are kind of eh. I really wish I had dagger mastery, but I don't have it. So vigilance or I'm gonna keep going crit. Because that helps for every, every fight. Leave and continue. Uh, let's see. More strength. More speed. And it seemed like speed has made me kind of ridiculous. Let's continue to be the fastest that there ever was. I like how I've just been badly poisoned this entire time and I just don't give a shit. Okay, anything short sword, don't care. Yeah, really the main problem would be like curses and stuff. That could that could mess me up. Uh, let's see. I got potions for days. But yeah, I can just crush things. Well, probably invest in some int as we go along too. I'll check out the greaves too, just because. Yeah, these guys barely do any damage to me. Compared to how much health I have? Oh, you know what? It would almost be a wise strategy. Uh, can I drink to heal? I feel refreshed. It doesn't get rid of the uh, poison, but whatever. That is ridiculously helpful. I'd be, like, scary strong if, uh... I would be scary strong if we, uh... Okay. Think it might be darkness time? I have no idea if it's darkness time. Well, that's fine. Oh, I got zero experience from being buried. Abandoned hovel. Yeah, let's check it out. Kitchen. Nothing. Library. Has another ascended. It's very weak ascended. We're not getting any EXP from some of these things. They're probably just too low level.
Oh. I've really got to go into the, into the darkness for this one. Okay, so it's a creepy shadow thing. Let's see, it hurts a bit. But it gave me EXP. Probably, uh, this one's level 10. Might be a little bit more worrying. Yeah, I might just want to take some of these hits for now. Monolith glows warmly. Yeah, so we're going to be attracting a bunch of these suckers. But I think I'll be fine. They do damage, but between my regeneration and uh, bandage, I'm kind of unstoppable. 